So um, it started off, uh, caused a bit of controversy because um, everyone was saying this is a bit too scary. A bit scary, yeah, it did apparently. <laughs> yeah. Um, well, I think that's it's. Uh, we we set out to make something that was very uh, exciting and uh, yeah, so I mean scary is sort of part. Well, the of good it, thing is, you see. Uh, I think if you're going to watch Jekyll and Hyde, you've got to know roughly what it's going to be. I mean, it's, a very, I it's a very modern take. And also, when I was you know, young watching the, the telly, watching Doctor Who, and it scared the life out of me, I yeah. loved that. Yeah. The hiding behind the sofa stuff. Those are the things you remember. Mm. Yeah, it's true, yeah. isn't it? You do. You sort of grow up, grow up with a bit of that. Yeah. I mean, I remember when I was younger, we used to read the Goosebumps books, which were sort of terrifying. That was... Um, they were just these little series of books, and they were absolutely terrifying. And... Uh, yeah, I think people do like being scared and, and everything, and, uh, and I, don't, I hope it doesn't sort of offend too many people. But uh, oh, you don't well, need to worry about it. Now that. they know what they're getting. Yes. So yeah. it's your choice if you switch it With on. That rock and roll clip as well. <laughs> <laughs> and and it is a bit Doctor Who, isn't it? A little bit Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Yes. That sort yeah. of thing, sort of very modern take. Yeah, yeah. And I think it's Ch uh, Charlie Higson's sort of mind, and, he, and he's put a. A Charlie Higson spin on everything. So any any of the monsters that we meet, as the series goes on, people are going to see more and more. They are not quite what they seem. So you think that it's a werewolf. It's not a werewolf. You think it's a sort of Frankenstein's monster. It's not. There's so he's used a lot of these classic gothic horror characters, but there's more to them that meets the eye, and you find out and as they go on. Find out. <laughs> and of course, you've got Richard E. Grant in there as well. Did, was, did you phone your mum and say what? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did. Uh, well, she happened to phone me, and we were filming out in this uh, beautiful garden in. Chatham and it was my first day with Richard um, which is always a bit old when you meet someone as iconic as that and they yeah. are face to face with them and the scene was which we will find is is me uh, losing my temper with him because uh, he's broken a promise and I pin him up against the wall and I'm about to bash his face in uh, and it was quite odd mum called me in in between takes and uh, and she said, how's your day? And I said, well, yeah, I'm pinning with nail up against a wall <laughs> uh, which is, doesn't become a bit any more silly than that. Uh, did he smell everything? He does. I You've heard of this. This he's is very smeller. strange. So Richard what does he is do? he's absolutely amazing. He, um, we were walking into this garden. There's obviously flowers and bushes everywhere, and he just uh, mid sentence shoves his head in a bush and just goes, "Oh my god!" And uh, he just loves smelling everything. And he's got this amazing. You know, he's got his perfume range out, which is absolutely lovely. And he gave me a bottle of it for my wrap present, uh, which is very kind of him. And, it's amazing. It's this amazing smell. He knows he's won awards for it and everything. And he just loves smells. But he, he smells, smells everything. everything. Smells everything. tables. Smells paper. Other people's really? coffee. Things that you don't think is is. Uh, I've got smells. Interesting. Yeah. yeah. I mean, there were these in his offices, uh, Richard E. Grant's offices. There's these sort of rubber curtains behind these sort of labs. He's sat there smelling rubber curtains and chairs and scripts, rubber pencils curtains. and everything. And <laughs> he'll be sat in the makeup chair, you know, and he just sort of picks up. The yeah. Sorry, this has got a bit it's weird now. <laughs>